Hello, my name is Sarah Ann and I'm one of the Wulongong Wizards. Um, today I'm going to get you guys to go through some drills that I have a lot of experience with. Um, coming to the Wulongong Wizards two years ago, my swimming wasn't quite up to par, so I spent a long time doing drills. And when I would do those, I would spend a few months at a time only doing drills. I didn't take a full stroke, I think, for two months, um, and it's helped my swimming a lot. Uh, so now we still have them sometimes in training, um, but we're doing a lot more swimming uh, since this is the middle of the race season. Um, and those drills, they go through a certain progression, so we do the whole progression every day. And I'm gonna demonstrate, uh, with Aaron's help, a few of the most important ones. So our first drill is pretty simple. Um, start nice and easy. So it's called short vessel, uh, because we pretend to be vessels while we're in the water, because vessels go fast. So the first one, um, you have your hands down by your side and you're basically just kicking on your side. So you'll be on your side and you have to make sure that uh, your face is towards the bottom of the pool and your shoulder is towards the bottom of the pool but you have to keep your shoulders very stable so you're completely on your side with your hands down by your side and when you have to when you breathe you only turn your head towards the air so you can get some air in and then put your head back in the water without moving your shoulder. The most important part about this drill is to be very stable. So it teaches you to um, stay on your side in the water and have a good body position. The kick is uh, not very important. It's just to keep you moving forward. A lot of times we'll do these with uh, fins on um, to help uh, stabilize the body. Um, and you can do, you can go down the pool on one side and then flip over to your other side for the way back.